Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel, whichever the case may be. My name is Rachel. It's been a minute since I've done a Disney Magic Kingdoms video, but today started the new mini event where we can get the classic costumes and the Steamboat Willie from the Platinum Chests. So I wanted to do something today that I literally rarely ever do. And that is take a gamble on getting the Steamboat Willie attraction from a Platinum Chest pack. I'm not sure if this is, if the Steamboat is permanent content, but I know the costumes are. So I wanted to just go for it and buy the pack. Now, I'm definitely <laughs> not someone that has never spent money in the game. I've spent a lot of money on platinum chests. As you can see, I still need syndrome for my Incredibles collection, also Mr. Incredible, but I'm not going to buy a chest pack for that. I am going to just try my look. So let's see what happens and wish me luck. Um, we, what you want to do though, before I do that, is they said on their live stream that you wanted to focus on getting Mickey's stuff because he can help get Minnie's, he can help get fabric for Minnie and Pete. And if you don't have Steamboat Willie and you don't get these, the fabric by the time the event is over, I think it runs for a week, you will be able to get them in Merlin's shop. Oh, and they are actually in Merlin's shop right now. Pete's fabric is in there. And that's all that's in there right now. So don't be afraid. You will be able to. And to get... Uh, elixir to spend in Merlin's shop all you have to do is sell your decorations that you have an abundance of like I don't need three lost love fountains and I should go in I never saw my concessions because I'm crazy and I like to keep them but I will go and sell all of the decoration that I have more than one of flag of corona I'm been getting those in the gold chests I actually haven't been getting a lot of decoration now that they've added a lot of tokens into the chests but it's been a minute since I've gone in here and exchanged my decoration for elixir so I why not just do that right now really fast seven wooden benches yeah I don't need seven wooden benches and I don't need seven hanging lanterns. <laughs> okay. Okay, time to buy this chest pack. Here we go. so nervous <laughs> I can't believe I'm doing this no turning back come on come on come on come on come on come on steamboat Willie uh, I did get a legendary but not what I wanted okay oh 
a friggin' planter. Let's hope that is the last planter we see. Oh my gosh. Oh. This is not what I wanted. Like, see, I would much rather get a token than a freaking planter or a decoration. Oh, okay, one more. This is it. This is our last chance. Please, 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 please. Uh, oh, okay. I'm happy with the Captain Hook's hat stand. But no luck. Darn it. I do have a platinum chest cooking right now in my chests that I had available to me. So hopefully, fingers crossed, that that will be the one. I just wanted to, you know, spice it up a little bit and do it for the video. I thought it would be fun even though it was a bust. Uh, let me know in the comments if you've gotten the Steamboat Willie, if you won it, because they did like a giveaway, or if Game Loft gave it to you, or if you were lucky enough to get it from a platinum chest, definitely let me know below how you're doing. I already obviously got the two fabric today. Remember to log in every day and you will get fabric and that's gonna help you that's you're at least gonna get Mickey's costume and you want to get him first because like I said they said he can help get fabric but we really need that steamboat Willie ah okay that was it short sweet I hope that you guys are enjoying this like mini event it still gives you the opportunity to level up your characters so definitely stay on top of that I'm currently I'm not leveling up anybody at the moment but I'm think I'm gonna wait I'm gonna once I get Olaf's last token I think I'm gonna level him up or Simba because he's ready to go I am almost done with Christopher Robin while well, collecting his tokens and bringing him to level 9 which I'm going to do I'm so happy that he's as high as he is I'm getting tokens for hero right now and then once I get all of the microbots I think I'm going to level up yokai because I have so many extra tokens for him that I think that he's going to be really easy to start collecting for again and I want to start getting my Big Hero 6 characters leveled up higher than they are. Just in case they're going to be in the next tower challenge. Because they've been around for, you know, a couple, a couple months and it's time to start leveling them up. I've been paying attention to so many other things. So I am going to work on Big Hero 6 slowly. I've, like I said in, um... My, I think it was my last Disney Magic Kingdoms video. I'm really working hardcore on my Lion King because I just have this feeling that they're going to at least help in the next tower challenge because they haven't been in one. So I have Zazu at 9, Nala's at 7, she needs to go up. I have Simba at 8 who's ready to go to 9 and I think I will be leveling him up. I have Scar at 6. Timon at 9 and Pumbaa at 9. Just in case they do what they did last time to us. Like when they added all we, that we had to get so many more tokens for Aladdin and Alice in Wonderland and Nightmare Before Christmas. I just want to be prepared to have these characters at least at level 9. So before the update happens I can just start leveling them up really fast and have them at 10. So that's what I'm doing. I'd love to hear what you guys are doing also. I'm very happy this is a totally laid back mini event. 
because it is, I mean, even though it is an event, it's something we're working towards. It's literally, we're not against the clock because this is permanent content and it still gives us the opportunity to level up characters. So it's a nice little break that we desperately need. But that is about it. I hope that you guys all have a magical day. Give this video a huge thumbs up if you're a Disney Magic Kingdoms fan. If you're not, definitely download the app. It's so much fun. I'm addicted. I've been playing for 294 consecutive days, which is crazy, and a total of 538. So I definitely highly recommend this game. Hit that subscribe button if you aren't already subscribed. And I will see you guys all in my next video. Bye!